Hi guys, Frost Fangs here, and welcome back once again to another Paladins video. Today we're going to be playing the new Knessa. I guess she's overall been buffed, although she did technically have the slow remove from her Q. Overall, I think it's a buff as far as I know. Uh, we're going to be using a new loadout as well as, I guess, uh, a, a different legendary card to the one I used in my last video. Not really sure just yet. She's got a new rifle. I think her body's the same, but the rifle was changed. I am still not sure if I like it or dislike it. I like the carbine version, but I think the rifle version looks a little bit worse, so it's, it's a bit of give and take. And this might actually be my last video on the Unbound system, because as you guys may have known, if you watched my last video, you already know everything. Cards Unbound is being removed, Battlegrounds has been removed from the main game of Paladins, it's going to be given its own separate thing. I don't know if there's even going to be Paladins characters in that, I don't think there is, I think it's literally going to be a completely separate thing that might have Paladins and Smite characters in it as skins. Not 100% sure, but either way, it still says there's a new mode when there's not. They've got rid of Battlegrounds, it used to be here. They also seemingly got rid of Onslaught temporarily, I think it's coming back, but right now there is no way to play Onslaught. You have Siege and Deathmatch. I guess we'll do Deathmatch. Not actually sure why Onslaught is gone. Hopefully they add it back soon because I would like to see it. And hopefully they actually get rid of the Unbound system soon because right now I feel like I'm playing for nothing. Like I'm getting cards. I don't really feel like it's doing anything for me because the whole card system is being changed soon. I actually got a lot of insight into it from you guys. I had quite a few people actually come out and say, hey, I liked the Unbound system and I'm actually kind of upset that they're removing it. Overall, the, the, the general consensus was, as I, as I guess, that the Unbound system wasn't really liked and that most people just accepted it, but there were quite a few people that actually enjoyed it. So I'm still interested to see where Paladins goes. I'm interested to see what the new card system is like. I really do hope they make it a lot better. I think there's also a new champion coming soon. I think his name is Khan and he's going to have a hook, or at least they tease something similar to that. There's no visual stuff out for him when I'm recording this video or anything at all. It's just like rumors and what they've hinted at, but that's going to be cool as well. Obviously, I'll cover him when he comes out. I also want to thank you guys for all the support you've been dropping on the videos recently, whether that's the Paladin stuff or the Fortnite video that I did the other day. We might have more Fortnite stuff coming in the future. You guys really seem to enjoy the video, although obviously there was a few of you that didn't, although I don't know why you'd click on a video with Fortnite in the thumbnail and title if you if you didn't want to watch a Fortnite video. That doesn't make sense to me, but thank you guys for the support you gave on that video. It's really nice to see that people still like what I make if it's not about Paladins, so a special shout out to those of you guys that dropped support on the Fortnite video, but overall, I just appreciate what you guys do, and I wanted to give you guys a thank you. Although I haven't played Paladins in a couple days, so this might be kind of rough, jumping straight into Kinesa. I haven't practiced Kinesa in a long time. The loadout we've got is pretty similar, although I have actually changed a few things around. I no longer buff anything to do with the teleporter because now the mines are completely different. I feel like it makes a lot of sense to actually buff the mines. So we've got extra movement speed while scoped. We also scope in a lot faster. I've got rid of the one that reveals people. It was useful, but I actually don't really know if I want it. I feel like if I had the card level 10 when it was revealing them for like five seconds, I'd use it. But right now, the way it is, I don't feel like it's a big enough buff to get rid of the other five that we're using. So the beam range of oppressor mines is extended. Uh, the cooldown of, ex of oppressor mines is also reduced. And the one that I now really, really like, that I think works well with Knesset is well stocked. Activating a mine generates one ammo every half a second for five seconds. So that's 10 ammo whenever we hit Q. I don't know if there's a cooldown timer in built in this, like if I throw both of my mines, if it's going to give me 20 ammo. I don't know exactly how that works. Um, gameplay wise, but either way, you throw a mine out and you get 10 ammo, which when you're actually like firing at your enemies and scoped in, that's like an extra three shots nearly, which is pretty damn good. So this is the second time in a row this has happened where I've played Paladins as Knessa, done the video, started everything, queued, and then been given Primal Court. The other thing is it's Onslaught. For some reason, TDM now queues you for TDM and Onslaught, I didn't know that. I guess that's cool, but for the people that wanted to play TDM or Onslaught, you're kind of screwed into joining both of them. Like, if I just wanted to play Team Deathmatch, right now I'm being forced into an Onslaught game. That's really dumb. I don't know why they didn't just make it two separate queues, like replace the Battlegrounds one with Onslaught. For some reason, Team Deathmatch now also includes Onslaught, but there you go. So we've got a Diamond 9 Tyra, a Diamond 14 Charlin, Diamond 9 Leanne, and a 13 Platinum Genos. Decent team. We could do with a tank instead of a Tyra, Charlin, and Leanne. We've right now got four damages and a healer. We're going up against a Grok, Ceres, Zin, Terminus, and Bomb King. They've got a much more standardized team, although they've only got one damage. I guess Grok is kind of damage and um, healer at the same time. He's also got the tagline Mr. Moneybags, which I, I don't know who that's for, or if that's for just like spending a bunch of money on crystals. I hope that that's a tagline you get for spending a bunch of money on Paladins, because that's kind of funny. Uh, their Bomb King's 25 Platinum, their Ceres is 21 Gold, and their Zin is 9 Diamond. The other two are unranked. So we have the ranked advantage, and I guess they have the leveled 
build advantage in this case by like a little bit. But I would say I do definitely have the composition advantage because right now I'm trying to play Kinesha on Primal Court. I am hopefully have learned from my mistakes last time, which was playing a little bit too defensively. Hopefully I'm a bit more aggressive and it works out better this time. I hopefully have learned from my last game we had on this. Legendary card, I would go for Eagle Eye if I trusted myself to land a bunch of headshots, but I honestly don't. Uh, suppression could be decent. I guess they deal 28 we deal 28% more damage to people affected by the mines so maybe I should try suppression I've never even tried this one steady aim is the standard safe pick and so is reposition but I don't feel like this is a good choice for this map so let's go suppression sure this is a load I've already shown you guys that this is the rifle um it is kind of nice I'd have to say I, I do like it for some reason that's super overexposed no idea why uh, I guess I'll get cauterized because they don't have any shields for me to counter let's do it two more things that I forgot to mention in the last video or already in this video the mount is like, like super third person. I don't know what they did. I do like it. You have a ridiculous amount of vision now when you're on your mount for some reason. Don't know why they decided to do that, but they did. Um, there's two shots. There's the Zin. Oh, God damn it. I Can I get away? I thought I was dead there. But not only are you now like in a super third person mode when you're on your mount, which I think visually looks really, really cool. Um, but you've also got your credit counter in the bottom right next to your abilities and stuff, which I genuinely also love. Uh, there's that. Holy shit. We generate so much ammo from using that. I forget. That 10 ammo is a lot when you've only got 24 bullets. Can you not do that, Zin? Thank you very much. I'm gonna die. Oh, I tried. He tried to peek around and I also tried to shoot him. Don't die, don't die, don't die. I'm trying to do better this game than I did in the last one because it was pretty painful. Oh, I missed that headshot. I missed that headshot too. I'm not used to this accuracy or this sensitivity. Sorry, not this accuracy. Jeez. There's another headshot. Can we get one more? I, I don't know why he took so long there. He was kind of just staring at me and I was staring back. Uh, there's a headshot. Okay, he's low. Oh, that was a good one. That was a headshot like just with the little bit of vision I had left. Holy shit. I also forget you can jump whilst you're in your scope all the time. I forget you can do that. Can you not do that, Zin? Please, I have a family. Does Knessa have a family? I'm, I'm not sure about the lore. Let's get more cauterized. We're doing decent. I do love the fact that my mines give me ammo now. That's great. I know it's a card, but it's a really useful thing to have on a card. There's 1200. There's 1500. God damn, I'm better than I was doing last time, that's for sure. I'm having a better time. We're losing more, but at least I'm having a more enjoyable game and hopefully more enjoyable for you guys to watch as well. There's a thousand. There's a thousand. Just trying to give him cauterize here, to be honest. Where are they at? Let's throw some mines out. That generates ammo so quickly. Now, if we throw two of them, it does seem to actually just keep going. Not sure exactly how that card's working, the one that gives us ammo, but it's working either way, and it's noticeable. I just got absolutely shredded by a Zin out of nowhere there as soon as I walked out of my spawn. That's a shame. I'm usually really bad at Knesset ult, so I'm not expecting for this to go great. I'll try and make it not suck, but I think we all know here, if you've watched my previous videos with Nessa, I'm about to suck real bad. Okay, that was okay. Uh, drop shot. There we go, Zin. Can we remove him, please? Or somebody? Wow, you've got the stun card? Why? I nearly got away. I'm so used to the teleport being instant. I really should have used this card, though. That 20%, 28% bonus damage is, like, really useful. We've still got our roll. I haven't used it yet. I'm just going to keep throwing my mines around. Where you at, Zin? I don't see you, my guy. I know you're behind that wall. You're taking 20 damage a tick. Did that not hit him? Um, excuse me. I'm calling bullshit. That was, like, bang on. At least I thought that was. I don't know, maybe I missed by like a little bit and didn't realize. Maybe. Uh, let's teleport away. Uh, nice one. I like how that worked completely how I intended it to. <laughs> what the fuck? It seems like our carbine also deals more damage than I remember, but don't quote me on that. I feel like it does. Throw that out. Where are they? I said try and run, but then literally couldn't see anyone. There's a shot. There's a shot. He's in his invis. There's a shot. I'm going to die if I don't teleport away. For some reason, I thought teleporting inward would be a good idea. I missed the terminus again. I'm twitching, like, way too much just before I hit the fire button. Oh, Bomb King. You got fucked there. I would have landed that one if the Leanne didn't kill him first, I swear. Let's throw some mines over. The range is not that long. I don't know why I threw it all the way up there, but all right. Um, hello, anybody? We have, like, we've had, like, no objective time, honestly. We're going to have, like, less than 30. Like, not just me, but, like, my entire team, probably. I don't think that anybody's been on that objective for very long. Let's get a little bit further back. Missed that one. Uh, there's 900. Anybody else? I missed that again. God damn. I'm missing by such a small amount. That Zin just took one to the mouth. Oh, he's so low. As soon as he as soon as he comes in. Bang. Okay, that didn't deal damage for some reason. There's 1,200. There's 1,200. Oh, I missed that one by like a little bit. There's missed that one by like a little bit as well. Bomb King, don't you try, my guy. Don't you dare. I'm going to throw my mines out. Jump around. For some reason, he wasn't able to kill me there. No idea what's going on. Try and run. Whoa, that speed buff, though. 1,400. Anybody else? Any takers? 900. Jesus Christ, we're just dealing like a 1,000 damage a hit here, whenever I land it, that is. 
1200. One more. Where's that Zin gone? Oh, I missed. Let's throw the mines out again. Sure. Oh, no. Just as he pulled his counter up. Oh, god damn it. Okay, where is he going? Where's he going? Has he dropped down? He has. 900. God damn, I do like nothing to this Terminus. Okay, we lost. I can't say I'm surprised. I tried playing Kinesa on Primal Court and we had four damage characters. I don't know why my team were like, yeah, let's go all damage. That's a great idea. Uh, I don't know if there's going to be any top play. Uh, apparently, there's no top play anymore. Um, I don't know if that's a bug or if I'm the only person who's experiencing that. But there's no top play anymore. Did they just remove the top play? I saw a couple of you guys actually saying in the comments of the last video that there is no top play anymore in Paladins. So I might not be the only person who had that. And like I guessed, nearly all of us had less than 30 seconds other than the Tyro who had like 19 on top of that. We could not get anywhere near the objective. I had second most damage in that entire game though. So I'll take it. I, I don't know if I'm just incredibly unlucky or if I'm somehow having the piss taken. But right now... The second game is also going to be Onslaught Primal Court. I was trying to play a team deathmatch on a map that wasn't Primal Court, but Paladins was like, F We've got a two unranked Drogos, uh, 17 Platinum Damba, a five Silver Ruckus, and a five Gold Shalin. I haven't seen a Diamond or a, uh, like a, a Masses in a long time. Uh, shout out to Hurani7. I think there was someone in my last game who also recognized me in the chat, but I can't remember if there was. Shout out to you. You're the real MVP. We're going up against a Zin, an Eevee, a Damba, a Strix, and a Kinesa. So they've got two Snipers uh, and an Eevee. They're all Diamond. I'm guessing they're like a team of five, maybe. I'm, I'm not sure. But they are two Flanks, a Healer, and two Damage. Okay, this could go kind of well. We've got Ruckers up front who isn't great, but if he just sits on the objective and outputs decent damage, he should be okay, especially if he picks the Rocket Legendary. Uh, let's get Suppression. Sure, same loadout. Uh, I guess I should get Anti-Heals again. This is really weird. I've never gone up against a Strix and a Nessa before, both on uh, Primal Court. Also, it seems like my spray wasn't the only one that's overexposed. That one there is also, like, way brighter than it should be. I also th see, It also seems like you can throw mines way further than you could before. Yeah, you definitely throw mines further than before. I don't know how much further, but it's definitely a little a little noticeable amount more than you could before. Like, it feels like they actually go where you're kind of directing them. Now, whereas they didn't before, get fucked enemy Strix. Eevee, did that not hit you? I swear that was like an inch near your face. Can we get a headshot here? As soon as she de Oh no, she wiggled to the right! Okay, we still got her. Thank you, Dama, for lowering her. Uh, this legendary card's actually way better than I thought it would be. That 30% extra damage is definitely noticeable, like a, like a pretty heavy amount as well. There's a headshot on that Damba. That wasn't a headshot. Thought it would be, though. Like a neck shot, I guess. Don't do that, Strix. That's mean. He can invis, so I just kind of had to fire there and hope that he was there. Let's go a little bit further back. Can we get a nice shot on him here? That's a Damba for some reason. We're winning right now, but I don't know how long that's going to last for. God damn it. Let's, should we teleport up there? I don't know what to do. My, my minds are just being destroyed all the damn time. We've got two of them sat up in that corner right there. Hello, Strix. You think you're slick, my guy. I'm, I'm taking damage from somewhere. I don't even know where from. Okay, it's the Eevee, I guess. Hello, Eevee. Oh, god damn it, that was a headshot. Oh, that was not a headshot. That was close enough, though. Come on, just give me a headshot, Hyrus. Just be nice, please. Where's she going? I'm trying to get vision on these people, but it's really, really hard. You just got fucked, Strix. Don't know what's going on there, my guy, but you just got nailed. Where? Where'd he go? Where'd he even run to? I don't know where that Strix went to. Oh, I see you, my guy. Oh, come on. I got two shots and it wasn't enough. Let's go jump that Strix. He's annoying me by camping so far at the back. Can I make that... Um, hello? Wait, can you not jump now with the mounts? Wait, hold up, what happened? Did they made it more zoomed out, and I think they also made the mount scale smaller? The mounts look smaller than before, but seemingly you can't jump now either, which is really weird. There we go, can we get him please? He's on like no health, and holy shit, that teleporter takes forever! I hit that teleporter like two or three seconds before I actually like, did anything. It doesn't give you a timer on how long it takes, but seriously, that took forever, look. Look at this, I hit F. Holy shit, that's so long. That may not seem like a long time, but when you're in a fight and taking damage, that's like a, like a pretty pretty decent chunk of time that you're just waiting for something to happen. There we go. Can we get that in as well? I got one nice shot this game on that Grok, and that's it. That was decent, I suppose. That was decent, I guess. I don't know. The best, I, the best shots I've got are like decent, I suppose. That shows you the level of skill we have here over on the Frostfangs channel. Um... Where's, where's that friggin' Strix gone? Oh, you're like right there. Get fucked. That's revenge, my guy. Headshot. That's not a headshot. Why do I say headshot when it's not a headshot? I don't know. It doesn't make the damage any better. Uh, Zin. Oh, come on. You turned around at the perfect time to counter that. That's some bullshit. 
Yo, Strix, you think you're slick? You think you're slick? How did you hit me around a corner? What the fuck? He's got a lot of movement speed. Holy shit, that damn was also nearly everything 10. I noticed the Zin had high leveled cards because he was moving incredibly quickly. Oh, son, you just took an L right there. Not today, Strix. Not today. No, get no, just no, get fucked, my guy, sit down, no, you've killed me enough times with your straight bullshit, also, Eevee, you're low, oh, jump shot, got it, okay, he's just chasing down the Zin, poor guy, he just got, like, dragon fisted, that can't be comfortable, Strix, oh, he ran out, I thought he ran back into his spawn, he ran out, never mind, uh, I see the Kinesa just chilling, I haven't actually really seen her all game, where has that Kinesa been, she's on a 12 streak, has she left her spawn, I swear I haven't seen her once, uh, let's teleport away. Again, that just really didn't help me at all. That kind of made my situation worse. Put a mine down. Oh, God, are we going to lose this game, by the way? Wow, we deal way more damage than I remember with that. Uh, there's a mine. Don't do it! Uh, get rid of that mine. doesn't slow, so I barely even pay attention to it, which is bad. Uh, there's one shot. There's two shots. Wow, I just shot that fucking Knesset in her kneecaps. Uh, let's go in. Sure. I What? Uh, Strix, I see you. I, for some reason, couldn't hit you. Zin, thank you for just running into the end of my rifle there. Appreciate you, guy. Uh, let's get this Eevee. Let's get this Eevee. I had enough of your bullshit, Eevee. I'm just gonna go straight carbine on your ass. Uh, where's that Kinesa gone? Shouldn't have jumped there. Should have just fired. Okay. 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 Oh, no. Oh, no. Ah, I'm, just, like, doing some sort of kids rhyme at this point. I just said, okay, okay, oh, no, oh, no. What's going on? Uh, more, more fucking mines for everybody. We can actually only have two out, which is a shame. But all right, it makes sense. Oh, she's gone. She's gone. She's gotta be gone. She's gotta be gone. Oh, no. Strix, don't shoot me. Fuck. Okay, we still killed that Eevee. She ran into a mine. This is hectic right now. We're losing by 40 points because Charlene doesn't understand how this game works. Why is Charlene not closer? There's 1,200. Can I get another one on her? Can we get another one? Is she going to peek back out? What's happening here? No? Okay. I haven't used my ult once yet this game. Just living up to my standards. Hello. Whoa. Try and run. Try and run, she says. Try and run or just accept the triple kill that is your fate. Oh my god, I landed two headshots right there and then finished off that damber. That possibly is the best Knesset play I've had in a long time. You're gone. No, Strix, don't do it. Oh my god. Wait for me to take three seconds to teleport, please, everybody who was shooting at me. I just need to get out of there real quick. You know what? Even if we lose this, I got a triple kill that was pretty damn spicy, so I'm happy. Let's get life rip and cauterize three because it's definitely going to matter for these last 15 seconds of this game. There we go. Where's the other one? You think you're slick, Kinesa, but you're not. That's a headshot to win the game. We out Kinesa'd the Kinesa who just ulted. Holy shit, that was close. Again, no top play, so I guess they did indeed actually remove it. Uh, champion chest, Kinesa. Cool, I'm, I'm, I guess I can open that. Like, don't know if it's even going to make any difference now the Unbound system is being removed. What a game, though. That was fantastic. I had so much fun with that. I've got two of them, apparently. I guess I leveled her up as well. We actually leveled the, the card well-stocked there and beam me up and open season and restore. Nice. So we had 70,000 damage, 500 less than the goddamn Strix. Although we did decent. We doubled nearly everyone on our team other than the Damba. We did double everyone on our team other than the Damba by like 4k which is pretty good, or 6k, sorry. I'm really good at maths. Yeah, we topped everybody other than the Strix. We topped the enemy Kinesa by 30k. I'm actually quite happy with that. And I actually got some decent plays in this video. We got a couple good snipes. We got the good one on the Grok. We got the triple kill, which was just ridiculous towards the end there. Um, I'm happy with that. And I would actually recommend this legendary card for Kinesa. It works pretty damn well. Way better than I thought it would. So thank you guys for watching. Leave a like if you enjoyed. Let me know what you want to see me do next. I'll see you guys all very, very soon. Thank you once again for all the support you've been dropping on the videos, whether that's Paladin stuff or Fortnite stuff. I really do appreciate it. And as always, stay frosty.